Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Um, I don't know what I did there. What was what were you thinking? Um, anyways, um, hi, <laughs> hi, and welcome back to my channel. My channel. <laughs> what is that? Nobody knows. Anyways, um, hi guys. <laughs> and welcome back to my channel if you are new to the channel or you just found me on as a recommendation or a suggestion thank you so much for clicking on my video please be sure to subscribe down below and what else oh yes hi my beautiful returning subscribers hope you guys are doing well and yeah so today's video i have no idea what i want to do that is fantastic. My skin is looking so great. It is what it is. Um, but yeah. Uh, but I know I definitely want to play with makeup. And I want to talk to you guys. That is the most important thing. So. Let's get into this. Uh, okay. Let's get into this. Okay. Um, so I've already done my brows off camera. I just felt like I've been doing my brows. And also I have an upcoming bra routine an updated one which is fantastic um i'm just going to play with makeup and talk to you guys um so today also before i start i want to ask if you guys are interested in me putting the links down below for the products that i use um i don't know if that makes your life easier but i definitely want to make your life easier so please let me know down below if you are interested in me putting the links to the actual products that i use Okay, let's get started. So today um, I will be priming with the Switch Beauty Primer Putty. <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to be adding this just so we can fill in the bevels. Like not that we have much, you know, just to, you know, do that thing. So what are we going to talk about today? Oh, I have a pimple. I actually have been treating it for uh, a minute now. And I really just wanted to go because I've been having such a good, like, skin. I've been having such good skin recently. Like, I've been taking care of it. Oh, my word. So, yeah. Also, your friend, like Amy, I'm your friend. I don't know if you know this. Um, but, yeah, I'm your friend. You can definitely always text me. Okay, not text me. Um, you can always find me on Instagram. Please put it, uh, actually, please follow me on Instagram. That would be fantastic. I don't know why I've been so stagnant on Instagram and I've been on Instagram for like the longest time. But you know what? It happens and we move. We're just going to be talking about random things, right? Um, recently... Okay, not that I need to be doing this, but your girl gets lonely sometimes, you know? Um, I haven't had a boyfriend. Actually, I realized the other day that I haven't had a boyfriend in like two years. Which is crazy, because how fine am I? Like, excuse me, ma'am, like, what is going on? Anyways, um, so I've... I actually have been wanting to get back. Okay, I actually need to ask you guys some. Uh, it's a bit <laughs> controversial. <laughs> but I just want to know. Should I? Oh, I actually forgot to tell you guys. Anyways, I'll tell you guys after this. Um, should I get back? with a old flame not a, like a flame as in like we never we never um we never like actually dated we were literally just in like the talking phase so i just wanted to know do you think i should actually give it a go because like currently i ain't got time for it right um i'm coming up with like really exciting stuff and 
I just don't know if I have time for that. Like I would love a relationship right now. I know that sounds very um, like desperate, dare I say desperate. Um, but sorry, I'm going in with going coconut spy ColourPop. Also, if I don't say anything that I'm using, it will definitely be down below. Um, so I was thinking if I should give him another try, right? But I don't know if I really want to do that um, because I am really currently very busy. Um, like obviously now with quarantine, because in South Africa we are still currently on lockdown. Um, it kind of makes you get in your feels that you don't have like someone to call someone to go visit like not that you can visit people but i'm just saying like it would be nice you know it would be nice if i could um but like it makes me think if i should be doing these things um yeah a lot of things have like happened not happened they say quarantine makes you think um a lot about things that you really shouldn't be thinking about you know what i mean um i've been thinking a lot how i would love to be in a relationship but then i think i'm like i am so busy where would this person fit in because um i guess if you really want it badly you will like make it work which is definitely a thing but i don't know and coming to this point i don't know if i'm just i'm just rambling right now but i would like one but i'm very busy so i don't want one but i'm i think it's like all the things that i've been watching recently <laughs> that's been playing a part in my kind of confusion not confusion I don't know if I'm making any sense right now. Okay, but the moral of the story, I've been thinking a lot that I would like to be in a relationship, but I'm currently busy with like a lot of things because I have work, I have assignments and exams, so basically university. Um, so I don't know where this person would fit in, but you know, I guess if it really is, I'm trying to sound not cliche, if it's really meant to be, it will be, but I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> so good. Anyways, um, I, would you go, would you go get back with like an ex flame? So we were just in the talking phase. We never became, okay. Also an important thing to know is that he did ghost. <laughs> I know this adds like another layer to what I just said. Um, but anyways, it is what it is. I've just been thinking. I haven't done anything. That's the most important thing. I haven't done anything. Um, I'm waiting for you to tell me if I should do it. Also, your friend, <laughs> me, I'm your friend. Um, I slid into those guys' DMs. <laughs> Oh gosh, okay. So I slid into this guy's DMs and I never do these things. Like, I was just like, I was, I think I was drunk when I did it. But, anyways, um, I did that and I basically, he didn't respond immediately and I was just like, oh shit. He's definitely, he's just, he's just seen it and he's just not gonna do anything about it. And I was just like, oh shit, Nathan, you fucked up. You really did that thing. What is wrong with you? Anyways, um, so then he finally responds. <laughs> and um, he's like, okay, but the way I did it was so smooth. Like, I had to give myself props. Congratulations. Um, it was so... 
<laughs> it was so spicy and I just don't know where I got that courage and it is what it is currently um but yeah so that's also a thing and also I realized well not realized um I, I spoke to him on the phone and I realized that he is three years younger than me <laughs> yeah so that is what's going on in your girl's life um, she's very confused. She don't know which way to go. And that's on period. <laughs> I just, I just don't know. Anyways. Um, but it was a great dive. And I think I'm gonna, like, ever since I've done that. Sorry for the kids that are screaming. It's just life. Um, ever since I've done that, I think I'm gonna do it more often. So if I slide in your DMs, don't be scared. Just respond. <laughs> Oh gosh, Nathan, you are too much. Anyways, um, I'm going to be, I'm doing cool tones. I don't know if you guys can see. If you can't, I probably should. Should I zoom you in? Okay, I'm going to zoom you in a bit closer. It doesn't even look like anything broski. Okay, let's do this color. I think I'm gonna do like a spotlight eye, a halo eye. Okay, also I think I wanna add a little bit of a different brown. Okay, I'm going to be going in with a different brown just to soften the outer corners. The outer edges, let's say that rather. Okay. I don't know why it looks so much better like here. Like in person than it is on camera. So I'm just going to go in with Coco Crush. Okay, so I'm going to be going in with the NYX. Can't stop, won't stop, get guap. Turn right toes and then toy flip flop. So my, all that lies need to stop because I'm icy wifey. He just want to fight me. <laughs> Cause I feel so comfortable with you. I do feel comfortable with you guys. <laughs> Going in with my concealer, I've started doing that thing to like lift your eye, so I really have been liking it because I think I used it in like my last video, a few videos after, and it's just, it's a banger, like the way it actually lifts your face is bananas, B-A-N-A-N-A-N. Let me put mascara on this eye. I don't know why. I just, I don't like seeing myself in like, not warm tones. I don't know. I need to get comfortable with being uncomfortable. Also, um, while we are getting ready and being as transparent as possible um we also need to um oh no talk about like our like i know some some of my traits are very toxic 
um, have you ever thought of what your toxic traits are um, some of the traits like the one toxic trait is uh, I don't know if it is toxic but I believe it is it's my it's my thing of trying to control everything and to me it just doesn't make any sense Nathalie like why some things you just can't control like you can't control the economy that's out of your control the only thing you can control is how you react to things and your behavior that is literally like your behavior and your beliefs and all that stuff that you can control in your life you can't control how a guy reacts to you um i don't know i just so i'm just gonna pounce this out and see I just feel like this thing, this concealer trick is just a banger. Banger, banger, banger. Another thing that I actually recently watched, I watched the photograph with Issa Rae and Lakeith Stanfield. Oh, that man is beautiful. Beautiful. Um, so I watched that movie and, oh. I feel like we need to get more represent. I know it's hard to say that we should get more representation, especially for like what they were talking about. I just love that movie so much. And I love the fact that it was kind of like someone that's my skin tone. Uh, it was a person of color. I love that. And why, I guess it's just like how it has been for a while and I pray that after this it will actually be better because I just love that movie I just felt like the music was great I just genuinely enjoyed that entire movie beyond everything I really enjoyed it so much and um, it really is such a beautiful movie okay so it's kind of like looking a bit better I did as wanted to stop. I don't know why I keep doing this to myself. Like I'm always like when it's like something that I'm not that is not like my comfort zone, I'm just like I just wanna leave it. Bronzer, there we go. I almost forgot the name. <laughs> um I haven't actually like liquid contoured in like the longest time. So I don't know how that would go if I tried it. I just don't feel like I have maybe. I should just give it another try maybe next video I'll try liquid contour contouring because I just usually like use a dark bronzer and that's like my version of contour So I actually saw this trick of smiling while bronzing um, from Roshana Isaacs. Um, she said that most of the time you aren't like when you smile, I, I don't ever smile. Like, I try not to smile because I feel like I want to give that bad bitch vibe, you know, so that's why I don't really smile. But when I smile, you know, it's a vibe, you know. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, so ooh, maybe I should actually do like a more cool, a cool tone highlight because the eyes are cool tone, so might as well. Let's try it. So I'm going to be going in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit and let's try Sunburst. This one right here. You can see how light it is. It doesn't even want to pick up. Okay, anyways, let's try it. If not, we go back. Mm, it's not bad. But I just like going for more of a glowy, bronzy vibe. So. Okay, it doesn't look that bad. Might as well go all the way all the way um and then we need to put on lashes 
do we want to put on lashes should we just no okay i'm going to keep the lip nude as i always do i just feel like it's better like that um so i'm going to be using my la girl lip lip liner it needs to be sharpened and i can't find my sharpener so shout out to that Okay, and then I'm gonna go in with my MAC twig. I actually, I had uh, my, oh, that's definitely not MAC twig. That was Cyber by, um, maybe I should bring that lip color back, but what, I, okay, I'll have to look it out. Anyways, um, I had the ColourPop Brink one, but I just don't know where I put it. Maybe it's somewhere in my car. So I'm gonna go off camera and put on my lashes and I'll be right back. Okay. And then what I like to do is use the same spray and just pounce it. Okay. Okay, so this is the finished look. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please don't forget to subscribe and I will see you next time.